problem number 13, we have the same thing. We have this square root thing, but the first thing I'm going to do right off the bat is I'm going to separate this into the square root of 8 times the square root of x. Now remember that 2 squared is equal to 4, so that means that 4, the square root of 4, is equal to 2. So I could take 8, because remember the 8 is equal to 4 times 2. I could take that and separate that into the square root of 4 times the square root of 2 times the square root of x. So I have the square root of 4, which is 2. Now what I'm going to do with this is I have the square root of 2, can't simplify that anymore. I have the square root of x, can't simplify that anymore. So I'm just going to toss those right back under the same radical, the same square root symbol. Okay? And you could do that. And that's it. That's the simplified version right there.